Hey, what's going on? It's Michael, San Diego Skateboard Longboard Race Club. Doing a little clip showing some of the boards that we have available. If you go on our um, sponsor's webpage, JesusRulesMinistry.com, you'll see that uh, we take in trades. We're the sponsors, obviously, of the racing club. And I'm going to show you some of the, the pricing and a few of the decks that we have available and give you a little bit more information on our custom decks that we also offer so let's just pan over and show you some of the goods that we got coming over here to the far end of the table <clears throat> probably best if I it's nine ply Canadian hard rock maple uh, double mini kick Got a nice concave, something like this. It's already taped, so 70 bucks. Uh, here we have a nice downhill free ride board, but it's going to be a top mount. Uh, this one again, $70. I think it's an 8 ply Canadian hard rock maple. This board is for freestyle, people who want a top mount. Uh, double kick, 9 ply, $70. I have these Maui and Sons boards right here. They're both uh, fifty dollars. No, this one's fifty, and this one would be a uh, forty max headroom or something like that, if I can remember from the '80s. And the Sector Nine deck. This is a nice, brand new deck as well. It's composite. All the decks I've showed you are new, except for the one on the end, which was just test ridden in front of the house a little bit. But the Sector 9 would be $40. It gets a little pricier when we get into the, the custom uh, made decks. This is, uh, again, Canadian Hard Rock Maple. But I've had to modify by trimming the sides and then finishing that. And then we have the wheel wells. Those had to be uh, cut out. It was also had the wheelbase changed and then it was converted to a drop through these decks range from roughly depending if I had blems to repair whatnot there are some for eighty dollars and we go to about hundred and thirty dollars this is another deck it's a drop down deck and it works well with uh, the the bear polar bear trucks and also I have this set up with some indie trucks it's a great board for beginners because of the uh, the drop down design and it works excellent with uh, traditional kingpin trucks swinging around uh, I have this Bustin that was traded in it's, it's got a nice flex to it something like that it's already gripped on the other side for like sixty dollars it's used this was a, uh, a drop deck that was converted to drop through so this would be like 70 this board right here has the opposite of a rocker has a camber so it would be a nice pump board uh, it's also a composite board something like sixty dollars the next one zooming in and zooming out is a really nice uh, double kick board Canadian hard rock maple 8 ply I'm thinking uh, seventy dollars for this one. Here's a nice cruiser board, already gripped, seventy dollars. I can't get this one. I picked up a few of these last year. Um, this is a double kick, really nice. This is I have a couple. I kept a couple of these for myself. It's a pool board. Uh, I can let something like this go for. Geez, I really don't want to sell it, but uh, $80 will twist my arm. And as I pan over here, I'm showing you the uh, little collection of 5 miles, all brand new decks. Uh, $70 for the Ram. Another $70 for the Statue of Liberty. They have uh, a drop deck. I actually have a couple more of these boards in the house that are already built, so you can ride them. And then uh, we're going to keep this one for a while. Really like the graphic, and it's a great um, freestyle board. This one would be probably about $90.
on top here we have a deck before modification again uh, I just want to emphasize on our custom boards for LDP we would uh, trim the size depending on who's going to be riding this uh, we would cut out the wheel wells right here and on top of that the wheelbase would be changed depending on who was riding this board again that's in the price range of our custom boards which would range from between eighty to hundred and thirty dollars and besides these few decks that I'm showing you here I have a lot more in the shop and then there are probably at least sixty boards already built with high-end parts I'm showing you a uh, sector nine before it was mod modified I've built this board and converted the wheelbase was too short originally as it sits but it had a nice micro drop so I turned this into a drop through board and then from there the wheelbase was changed had more room without my feet then weren't tagging the wheels and it became one of my just really fun board to ride and this modified I'm thinking uh, hundred dollars without the grip tape and you know I just would like to show one other board briefly I forgot to bring it out here taking a step back in the house I'll just throw it up here on the table the board I'm showing you originally started something like this one on top of this black and decker table but more precisely it's this board right here and obviously well that's a word I've been playing out pretty much but wheel wells cut out wheelbase changed I've got some rogue trucks on here with some uh, riptide bushings 93 WFB with the 87 crank double double tall barrels with some uh, I don't know Kegel I think orangutan wheels and I flip the wheels I find that when you uh, if you get the wheels closer in there's less flex on the board and it just makes the ride faster anyhow I, I wanted to pull this board out because no matter whether whether you ride one of our 60 demos that we have um, pre-built or you choose a deck here I have just an enormous amount of uh, brand name products from trucks and wheels just a long list if you were to look at a catalog at a store and look at all the brands it's pretty much um, what I have in my shop and what we like to do and the reason is kind of like out of my own um, experience of skateboarding it was I spent thousands of dollars really getting the right setup what I liked and so through the club I'm trying to make that process a little simpler by being able to uh, pick a deck design you want whether it's a drop through a double drop a top mount or a drop down deck pick the trucks you like we don't sell components basically this is just a, a service we um, operate through the club to uh, make decks available it also helps us get product for the ministry because we barter and trade for uh, parts for a deck along with uh, sometimes a small small cash donation works out really well so we can continue to buy uh, more wood and make them available to all our club members membership for the club is free and go to Jesus Rules Ministry it's uh, the dot com and we have on the tabs there's a section uh, about the club it'll bring you to uh, meetup.com in San Diego long San Diego skateboard longboard race club which I mentioned as I started this video and then on top of that uh, I have a Facebook page Michael Lanigan we post some of our uh, news and parts of the uh, 
whether we do a run showing you know different locations where we skate anyway that's a different story so let me close off by saying thanks for uh, checking in I think I covered uh, gave kind of an oversight of what our pricing is and talked a little bit about how we uh, do things and and I hope that is informative all right then thumbs up on that thank you for uh, again for checking in Michael San Diego Skateboard Longboard Race Club and I am signing off See ya.